So you've been staring on your phone all day. And whilst you've been staring, scrolling on social media, you see all this negativity. All this negative, depressing, hateful stuff online, on social media. All the hate, negativity. Yet, we wonder, we wonder why our mental health is so bad. Hey, first things first, how are you? I hope things have been good and I hope you've been alright. My nose is a little bunged up at the moment, so if I sound like shit, then that is why. <laughs> you see, I want to tell you a story of something that literally happened today. I was driving on the way back. The usual route from work after I go to the gym and I skate. The same route I drive on my motorcycle every single day. Same route. I was driving, driving stuck in traffic this one well, not traffic there's one really slow car in front of me and i was getting tired annoyed so i looked to my left and what do i see the biggest woods i have ever seen uphill and golden rays of sun shining through the woods and off to the distance there were deer there was deer jumping through this overgrown forest and it was the most beautiful thing i've ever seen and you know what I thought to myself? Do you know what the first thing that came to my mind? I have driven on this same lane for the past couple years. How have I not noticed this? How have I not seen this? After these videos, after I've finished recording today, I'm going to go out. And I'm going to go back to those, those woods, those very same woods. And I'm going to go explore. You see, there is something that I've come to understand. That life is a lot more positive than I think. And the reason why I... Not just me, so many of us, probably you too, so many of us have such a negative style of thinking. Our mind is so negative. It thinks negative things all the time and it's because of how much we spend our minds online. So much of online social media, Instagram, TikTok, even this platform, even YouTube, so much of it is negative, not a lot of it is actually positive. I mean, yes, I'm appreciative. I want to help as many people as possible. I'm appreciative of people, I appreciate people clicking on these and actually learning something, and I actually manage to help them. That's why I do this. You know, now I, there are some other YouTubers that I see on Southern Boomer, and they sort of choose to do really clickbaity stuff, and that's because they choose views and money over helping others. I see a lot of other self-improvement YouTubers do this. There are plenty out there who don't, who genuinely care about their following. My end goal is for you to never ever need this channel ever again. For you to grow and actually experience on your own. So much of our minds' negative thinking is so influenced by the online, by the virtual world. And this is what I want you to do. I want you to look up. Every time you're walking through town, listening to that super negative, depressing music, or even worse, watching something as you're walking, which I have seen people do, it's pretty messed up, but I've seen it, you know, they've got, they're quite young, they've got headphones on, and they're literally staring at their phone as they're walking across the road. I'm like, bro, you're about to die. What the fuck? When you're next walking, looking down at the ground, and for some reason you don't even realize you're doing it, and you can't look up for some reason, you struggle to even bring your eyes off from the ground. Next time you're doing that, listening to depressing music, I want you to look up. Just look up, look around you. Take out those earphones or headphones. And when you're walking, you're looking up, just try and look everywhere at your surroundings. Try and talk to as many people on your little walk, on your journey to wherever it is you need to go. Try and talk to as many people as possible, but maybe you can't do that. So instead, just try smile at as many people as you can, because you'll be surprised about how little we do this, how little everyone does this, and how much of an impact it will have on others and yourself. You will see other people smile back at you just because you were smiling at them. Just spend a little bit more time away from your phone, away from this negativity that is known as the virtual world, and spend a little bit more time 
in reality. This little tiny thing, you know, when you walk, instead of looking down at the ground, just looking up, smiling at as many people as you can, that's enough for you to start to realize that, you know what? Maybe life's not so bad. Is all right, is all right. Like how I did today. When I was driving, annoyed, sat behind a slow car, unable to overtake, I instead of just always looking in front of me, I looked to my left and I saw the most beautiful scene, woods, deer, the sun, that I never ever saw before, despite driving on that route for a couple years. That's how much of a difference that this tiny little habit could make. The world isn't as bad as you think, or at least the world isn't as bad as the internet makes you to believe. Hopefully this helped you out, and I hope things have been good, I hope you've been alright. And I would be really appreciative if you clicked on this video that's going to pop up in the corner here, because this video could help you out. And subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Stay consistent and don't give up. <laughs> okay, come here. Self-improvement gifts.